All right, welcome guys, welcome to Puppy School. My name's Cameron, I'll be your trainer today. Uh, today we're gonna go through a bit of fun. We're gonna have these guys doing sit drop stands. Um, and if we've got someone who's overachieving, we'll challenge them a little bit more. Pet Stock Puppy School is specifically designed for dogs between eight and 18 weeks. Now, while this period can be very hectic and busy for the owners, it's the most important time developmentally for your dog. I'm with Cam here from Pet Stock Puppy School. Cam, why is it so important to bring your dog to puppy school? Well, you see, Gotten, um, Puppies, when they are born, um, up until about 18 weeks, is their critical development period. They learn a lot from their surroundings, different puppies. They learn that you know puppies come in all different shapes and sizes. You know they're small, they're big, they're fluffy, they're short-haired, and some don't like other dogs. Some love other dogs. So it's all about learning. You know this crazy wild world that we live in. Absolutely, yeah. socialisation. <laughs> exactly. Living with others. Yes. If a puppy misses out on the chance to have this genetic opportunity to learn about these things at this age, it can lead to a lifetime of fear and possible aggression, as they simply don't understand how to interact with other dogs or people. Or they may become fearful of the many everyday situations they may face. So, it generally it's easier for a puppy to learn than an older dog? Absolutely. Um, even though when they are adolescents, you still need to expose them to everything, when they are puppies, it's sort of like their permanent learning stage. They learn everything and it generally sticks with them for their whole life. So it's a lot harder to teach an old dog new tricks? It is harder, it is doable, but it's a lot harder, yes. So, right now, we're having a go at getting our dogs to drop. George is four years old, so I hope he can do it. George, drop. Good boy! Good boy. <laughs> You'd expect him to do well when he's four years old, past puppy school. <laughs> so what are some of the things people will learn at puppy school? Well, first off, we learn how to communicate with the dogs. So we learn that high pitch is playtime, low pitch is I'm in trouble. Uh, then we learn what treats are actually good for dogs. So the smellier the treat, the better. We're going to get a better result out of the dog. If it's a boring treat, they're going to be bored and they're going to play with their friends instead. Uh, we go through all your basic commands, so how to sit, drop, stand, sit, stays, loose lead, walking, and how to recall. And we also teach them how to play with dogs safely in a controlled environment where we control where they play and have fun. Their program is based on using a reward-based training method which teaches pet parents how to communicate with your puppy or dog, how to develop solid foundation obedience in all environments, the importance of socialisation, mental and physical stimulation, ways to help curb any behavioural problems, how to find the correct equipment for your dog, and the appropriate rewards to use to get the best results. Fantastic. Sounds like it's really important to get some training for your puppy. Yeah. And not to mention how good it is for the puppy himself. Yeah. <laughs> so, uh, how can I find out more about uh, Pet Stock Puppy School? So, either on our website or just pop into your local store and have a chat to one of the friendly staff and they'll tell you all about it. Cam, thanks a lot. No worries. <laughs> Well, you're using the salmon treats again, aren't you? The smellier the better. Stinky salmon. <laughs>